Hey guys, it's iPod Touch Girl 22 and I have a super nice review. I just received this in the mail a couple minutes ago, hours ago, whatever. Uh, it's from ctadigital.com. A link for their website will be down below. They have lots of cool things for iPod, iPhone, speakers, cases, and particularly what I have to review, they sent out for me to review, is a game controller grip for iPhone and iPod Touch. So I'm going to open it up real quick. I have already gotten it out and um, I played around with it a little bit. So my iPod is already in it. Let's see. Um, I think it's best for car racing and anything like that, like race car games. So it's, it's super good with those. And so it only works in horizontal position, as you can see right here. Set this to the side real quick. Um, so this is what it looks like. It looks kind of similar to uh, PlayStation controllers and other game controllers you've seen. It looks like the design of it looks pretty similar to that other than the big cutout and no buttons. And it obviously doesn't need any batteries. But anyway, this, this is from CTA Digital. They were really kind enough to send me this out. And a quick little bit about it. Uh, it came with four different pieces for it. Let's see what we got. There's the iPhone 3G one. So it works with iPhone 3G, iTouch, the first generation, iPhone is this one, and the first, just the iPhone. And then the one I have in right now would be the iPod Touch 2G little case on it to make it work for this one. Uh, I guess it works with 3G also because I think they're like really similar. So I won't ever be using these, so I'll just set them to the side. And let's see. Um, now, so like I said, it works specifically for landscape mode. And um, let's see. Uh, like I said, good for race car games. I'm going to do just a quick game, uh, Crash Cart. I'm sure a lot of you have heard about this. I'll zoom in a little bit. So, it's, it's, it makes it a lot easier to hold onto the iPod. So you just tilt it left and right. Very easy. Make it. So I like it way better than just holding the iPod, playing this game, it's a little hard. And if you haven't gotten this game, I do recommend getting it, it is super fun. So yeah, that's about it of this game. Okay, so next, let's see, it does have a few downsides, um, to specifically get it out of the controller, you're supposed to press the back of it, which will release it. I'm scared I'm going to break it. So that was fairly simple, and it is kind of hard to get the case off. And it, it, it scares me that I'm going to scratch up my iPod even more on putting my case when putting it in. Because it does have a really tight fit. Uh, another uh, downside is you can't reach the volume rockers once you put it in. So you can't reach the volume rockers. But one plus side is you can charge it and listen, put your headphones in from this side while you play. So that's also a really good thing. Uh, you honestly don't really need the volume rockers because you just double click the home button. Or not, just kidding. And also you can't lock your phone. Another downside. Just You just wait for that. So that's about it. I overall uh, think this is super nice and I think it'll be good for vacation. And um, whenever I play like a race car game, whatever, crash cart, and holding the iPod, I don't know if this is, it's kind of weird, but my hands get sore of holding it because it's so small.
So this just makes it a lot easier to hold on to and a lot more comfortable. So that's about it. Thanks for watching. Thank you CTA Digital for sending this out for me to review. And they have a super nice website. Go check them out and buy something from them. Yeah, that's about it. Remember, subscribe, subscribe, comment, rate, oh no, thumbs up, and favorite. So I'll see you guys later. Peace out.